I don't know where to begin. <laughs> oh, that was my sh that was my shoulder that cracked. Nah. Ugh. Everybody, what's up? It's Brandy. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. Now, in today's video, we will be creating this look here inspired by Tetris. Lately, in quarantine, it's basically the only video game that I've really been playing. So, I thought, why not create a look off of it? Why not? Anyway, if you guys are interested in how I create this look, then please keep on watching. I do apologize if you hear background noises. It's the construction going outside of my house. There is a lot to do, so to save time, I already did my foundation, I primed, and I already set my eyes, as always, using the Maybelline The City Mini Palette. Now it is time to move on to the forehead. Let's do this. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to cheat a little bit, only because my skin has been acting out in my eyes. I don't know what is going on. I don't know if it's the makeup. I don't know if it's the after care that I'm doing that's causing my skin to kind of have a reaction. I want to try and put on less makeup as possible. So I'm going to be grabbing this. This is paint tape. I don't remember where I got this from. I'm just going to be taking a little bit and making it into the shape of a T and then placing that on my forehead. Dipping into my James Charles palette, the first color I'm taking is Brother. This does not want to stick. Whatever. I'm just going to be placing that shade all over the forehead. Next, grabbing my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Concealer. Where is this brush? Here it is. I'm going to be cleaning up right up here and just right over here to make it nice and sharp. Next shade I'm dipping into is Cola. And I'm just going to apply this in the T-zone. Now I'm going to be dipping into my NYX white liner. And I'm going to be outlining the T. Now for the part I've been dreading the most, which is the name Tetris. So I'm going to be dipping into my concealer and we're going to slowly, slowly begin this process. <laughs> Okay, so the first color I'm dipping into is You're Kidding. For the E, I'm going to be dipping into 518. For the other T, I'm going to be dipping into the shade B. Grabbing the shade Shul. <laughs> okay, tongue twister. Let's try this again. Grabbing the shade Social Blade. Next, taking the shade Playground.
Last but not least, dipping into the shade Single. I look extra, extra crazy today, but it's okay. <laughs> now it's time for the eyes, and for that, the first shade I'm dipping into is Love That. And I'm just going to apply this in the crease. Next color I'm dipping into is Spooky. And I'm going to apply this in the outer corner as well as the crease. Now it's time to cut the crease. Next, I'm going to be mixing the shade B and Flashback together. Okay. <laughs> Next, I'm going to be dipping into the shade Hello. The next shade I'm dipping into is Face, and I'm going to top this over the shade B and Flashback. Next shade I'm going to be using is Artistry. Next two shades I'm going to be mixing is Single and Escape, just to help deepen this outer corner and blend it even more. Going back into the shade, love that, and running that underneath. Then going back into the shade Hello. Then going into the shade Spooky to deepen the outer corner a little bit more. I don't know what happened with my camera, but all I did for right under here is I mixed the shades B and Flashback again as I did to the top and then topping that off with the shade Face. Of course, there's only one shade that I ever really love to highlight the inner corner of my eyes and that is Ranch from my Conspiracy palette. Next, I'm going to be curling my lashes, and then, holy cow, <clears throat> excuse me. So, as I was saying, <laughs> next I'm going to be curling my lashes, and then applying some mascara with my Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect Waterproof Mascara. Next shade I'm dipping into is Playground. I'm going to be creating the boxes by dipping into Spooky. The next shade I'm dipping into is You're Kidding. I'm 
Next, going into the shade 518. Then dipping into the shade Love That. Dipping in to Social Blade. Next color I'm dipping into is Skip. Next, I'm going to be dipping into the shade B. I'm going to go back in to all those different colors and continue those shapes on this side. Alright, so now I'm going to be going back into 518 and I'm going to be <laughs> I don't know what that was. Okay, so I'm going to go back into 518 and I'm going to be creating. That's what I meant to set. Are you coming in now? No, you just split. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, so grabbing 518, I'm going to be creating a floating, you know, like a falling block. And then I'm going to do one over here in another color. So now we are on to the last block and for that I'm going to be dipping into Skip. Last but not least is the lips, and for that I'm going to be grabbing my Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit Matte Lipstick in the shade Give Me Mocha. Then I'm going to be grabbing my Wet n Wild Bear It All Lipstick. Alright you guys, this is the final look. What do you all think? Let me know in the comments section. As always, every product used in today's video will be linked down below in the description box. I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, please don't forget to give it a big... <laughs> okay, let's try this again. If you guys enjoyed today's... If you guys enjoyed today's video, then please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up because I would really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. <laughs> Bye, guys.